Free radicals are highly reactive species that are present in our bodies. The most important type present in our body are those that are known as reactive oxygen species. Reactive oxygen species are simply chemically reactive molecules containing oxygen. Research suggests that free radicals play a key role in both normal biological function and in certain human diseases. Free radicals and other reactive oxygen species are produced in all living organisms and have biological advantage. They are essential in the synthesis of energy and essential molecules, and they are also involved in boosting our immune system. When free radicals and other reactive oxygen species accumulate in the body, they cause damage to cells, DNA, lipids, sugars, and proteins. The damage caused by free radicals and reactive oxygen species in plants and animals could lead to deterioration of foods, cell membrane dysfunction, protein modification, enzyme inactivation, and the breaking up of DNA strands. Free radical-induced oxidative damage may be a precursor to aging and diseases such as cancer. So how do we compensate for these dangers? Antioxidants are among the variety of defense mechanisms against oxidative stress induced by free radicals. Examples of well-studied free radical scavenger antioxidants are vitamin E, vitamin C, flavonoids, chlorophyll, and carotenoids. Growing number of research on the role of antioxidants suggests that there is a strong association between high intake of antioxidants and low incidence of diseases, such as cancer, that are linked with free radicals. Antioxidants, including vitamin C, vitamin E, and beta-carotene, block oxidative processes which produce free radicals. Antioxidants also protect against the actual damage produced by the free radicals. Antioxidants have been shown to directly block chemical carcinogens, or cancer-causing agents. Cells have antioxidant systems catalyzed by antioxidants to convert oxidants into non-toxic substances. Antioxidants are capable of neutralizing oxidants and their actions at different stages. These three stages are referred to as preventative, interception, and repair. At the preventative stage, the reactive oxygen species are stopped from forming. In the interception stage, the function is mainly through a scavenging or collection process. And at the repair level, it is primarily enzymatic antioxidants, or antioxidants that catalyze the conversion of free radicals into safer species. The aim of using a high intake of antioxidants is to achieve balance between oxidant production and the removal by antioxidants. Let's take a look at what we've discussed in this video. Free radicals are created as a byproduct of normal processes within the body. Free radicals can damage cells, potentially leading to accelerated aging and the development of disease. Although, as we mentioned, the news is not all bad, antioxidants can be consumed as part of a healthy diet to counteract the free radical damage.